to read a book with our very own outstanding BAM librarian, Miss Mardan. The book talks about this past year's challenges. Even though it has been and continues to be tough, the book reminds us that we're all in this together. Speaking of being together, where's Miss Mardan? I'm so excited to read with her. Oh, Spoony, you're already here. I'm sorry, I hope I didn't make you wait too long. No, not long at all. I'm just so excited to read with you, and uh, this is kind of a dream come true. Oh, thank you, Spoony. Well, we have a really special book to read. It's called Outside Inside by Lu Yen Pham. Looks amazing. Can we uh, take turns where maybe you read, and then I read, and then you read, and then I read? Yeah, that would be great. You can go first. Thank you, Spoonie. Outside Inside by Lu Yan Pham. Something strange happened on an unremarkable day just before the season changed. Everybody who was outside went inside. Everyone, everywhere, all over the world. Everyone just went inside, shut their doors, and waited. Well, almost everyone. Some people needed to be where they needed to be. Outside, the sky was quiet, but the wind still blew, and birds kept singing. Raccoons came out, and squirrels played in the streets, but the cars stayed away. The world felt a little different. Inside, we baked and cooked, made music and watched TV. We read and played games. Some of us worked a little, some of us worked a lot, and some of us couldn't work at all. We all felt a little different. Outside, there were fences, both real and pretend. Swing sets sat still, and slides were lonely. Bells didn't ring, and halls were empty. We had birthdays without parties, shared words without sounds, and reached each other without touching. The world was changing a tiny bit outside. Inside, we waited and we worried. We laughed and we cried and we tried to breathe. We made things together and did things alone. We hoped and prayed and wished. We were all changing a tiny bit inside. Outside, the world kept growing. Inside, we kept growing too. So why did we all go inside? Well, there were lots of reasons but mostly because everyone knew it was the right thing to do. On the outside, we are all different. But on the inside, we are all the same. And we remembered that soon spring would come. Inside and outside. What a beautiful book. I feel calm and yet I feel uplifted and hopeful. 
Me too. This book reminds me that we're all connected. Some of us are here at school and some of us are still at home, but we're still one BAM community and that makes me feel really happy. Wise words, Miss Mardung. And the book said spring would come and by golly, spring has sprung. It has indeed sprung. And spring is the season of change, growth, and new beginnings. And just like spring, and just like this book, let's remember to grow together and the change is a coming. Thank you for reading with me, Spoonie. Thank you for reading with me, Miss Mardan. I can't believe that we're actually reading this book together. Amazing. Um, well, uh, I'm really glad we got to read together and happy springtime. Now I'm gonna go use my cork nose to smell some springtime flowers. You do that, Spoonie. Bye. Bye-bye. Go Bam Coyote.